Music plays an important role in my life. I'm a professional violinist. I teach private violin and viola lessons. And my occupation is an elementary school music teacher. I selected some songs from four amazing composers over four different centuries and created something new out of it. You see, all of us have not only the capacity to create music, but we're inherently designed to benefit from it. All of us can and should create music uh, in our lives. You see, music, it's all around us, everywhere. We've got Pandora, YouTube, iPhones, music concerts, television, sporting events. We've got our Bluetooth speakers, surround sound. We have dynamite cars with souped up with awesome stereo systems. Well, now that I think about it, we have some not so souped up cars. <laughs> oh, come on, give me some credit. I'm a music teacher after all. all right. You see, music is essential for our lives and for the benefit of our minds and our bodies and our soul. You know, music increases our, our brain connections. It connects deep down with our emotions. And it's just a very powerful tool for us to connect with the world around us. Music transcends cultures and language. Across the globe, we can understand music from anywhere. We all understand the power of an African drum circle. And parents of newborns inherently uh, sing to their children at night, uh, eat just to calm them down. Funny story. My first son, Caleb, when he was born, somebody gave us this awful mobile. And it played what I thought was a horrible arrangement of Brahms' lullaby. I swore I would never use it. But then, at night, as my son cried and cried, I had to just try it. And it turns out, it was the only thing that, <laughs> that helped calm him down. <laughs> my wife still laughs at the thought of me turning that crank over and over every night in order to calm him down. Music is very powerful. I, we, ex, we experience music and create music even from an early age. I think every two-year-old is a natural drummer. My other son, Josh, he and his cousin love to dig through our cabinets in our, in our kitchen and pull out all the pots and pans to create a drum set, which they do on a weekly basis. They love to create music. And music has lots of beneficial things for us as people. I'd like to talk about the science behind music for just, for just a moment. When they analyze the brains of musicians when they're creating or performing, the whole brain lights up. They're using all the different parts, all different new pathways connecting across the entire uh, brain on the top of our head here. It's amazing. Well, I guess this makes sense. Because mus musicians were reading notes, paying attention to rhythm, and were listening to pitch all the time while we're trying to expressively perform. Music not only strengthens our mind, but it also connects with us deep down inside, those emotions that we don't have words for. If you've ever had a bad day, <laughs> and you've gone and turned on the radio, and you felt better, that's the cathartic power of music, or letting go of emotions by experiencing music. And not only that, but music increases the myelination of our axons and develops fine and gross motor control. Whoa, hold on a second, Mr. Dunger. 
Them be some big and fancy words there. <laughs> okay, let me see if I can channel Bill Nye the science guy for a moment to help us out. The myelination of axon is the insulation that connects uh, our brain cells together. And that myelin sheath that connects it, the more insulation that there is, the faster that your mind can do something. So we got a little experiment here. I want everyone, you're gonna say your alphabet as fast as you can. Awesome, everyone must have had a fantastic kindergarten teacher. <laughs> now, say it backwards as fast as you can. <laughs> ah. <laughs> we just discovered that we either don't have those pathways connected yet in our minds, or the pathways that we have, they don't have a lot of myelination, so it's a little bit slower. Could you get faster? Absolutely. You'd practice, you'd make no more new pathways, we'd add more myelination to your brain, and it would be just as fast. Let us not forget that if you Sing your ABCs at the same time. You will add another pathway, as well as more myelination. You laugh, but it's a powerful way to help you remember, remember other things. It adds another layer of your learning uh, with that. Not only does music, creating music, fine tune your brain, uh, it fine tunes your body a little bit as well. So you have your fine motor control that develops. And fine motor control are things like texting, playing video games, or as we saw, playing piano uh, in here. Gross motor control are things such as skateboarding, playing soccer, or even the musical theater majors that we see on those Broadway shows and in movies. They have to use their bodies across the stage and sing their part all at the same time. It's very, very powerful on all those different connections. Let us not forget that we are obsessed with those who create music. We have concerts that sell out in minutes that people pay hundreds of dollars for, for tickets. We have musicians vying to showcase their talent on the next big uh, reality TV show. And deep down, all of us believe that we, too, could do that. And I'm here to tell you, you're right. Each of us can create powerful music, regardless of our age, who our parents are, our family, or our friends. Each of us can and should create music. Now, for some of us, this is not really a secret. My brother-in-law, Brian Johnson, was just on the seasons of The Voice. He was on Team Blake, all about that bass. Megan Trainer cried during his coaching session from the beautiful music. He was stolen by Adam Levine and then was in the top 12 this week. For him, music has already manifested itself into a powerful form of his life. Very important part. I have high school students who are taking violin lessons with me. And they're taking those lessons because they love music and they love creating it. And some amazing things happen every week. They're studying and learning music, but they're also studying alongside that how their mind learns. They're growing and understanding themselves and what do they need to do to understand it. The amazing part is that they then are growing to the point that they no longer need me as the teacher. Their success is their own. So what about the rest of us? I think we all believe that music is important for our lives, but I think we marginalize the role that it plays. I think it's akin to healthy food. We all know that we should eat healthy, and music's the same way. We need to create and enjoy music 
at all stages of our lives. So how do we do that? I think we are all creators still. We have our instruments at home. We have guitar hero. We've got our karaoke machines. You've got your phones and tablets to create music, beatboxing apps, all sorts of amazing things. The real question is who in this audience is going to be the first one tonight to record themselves singing and post a new vine? Who is the next, going to be the next rock star techno DJ who's using their laptop for their new mix? Who's going to take that instrument out that's been in the back of their closet since the fourth grade? Who's going to start taking lessons, music lessons? Who's going to be the drummer with their pencils on the desk Monday morning, waiting for the teacher to start class? Don't blame me if you get in trouble. Not me. <laughs> Who's going to sing in the car on the way home? Who's going to get their dad to sing Call Me Maybe with you on the way home? <laughs> you see, we're all creators of music. And not just my two-year-old on his pots and pans, or my brother-in-law on television. All of us lead richer, fuller, and more balanced lives when we allow ourselves to connect with our musical intellect. So the next time you look at that reality TV show and those musicians performing and think, yeah, I could do that, I want you to know you are right. Maybe you can't be famous for it, but we all can and should create, create music because our brains are realizing what our mind already knows, that our lives will be richer because of it. Thank you.